Hello, hello everyone. It's Stray Faye here with another episode of Harvest Moon Grand Bazaar. Alright, what are we doing today? Feels like it's been eternity since I've played this game. Uh, but for you guys, it's only been a day. Uh, so what are we doing? We are almost done with year four of spring. Gonna get into summer, hopefully do another rival event. I've been actually looking at um, all the little tasks I need to do to like get 100% completion. There's a lot of things that require rain, like the bugs I need and a lot of the events I need. Such as the girl gossip event that I need. So I think, for starters, uh, I'm gonna do a little scumming since I think I've set it up pretty well uh, where I can just reload these two days and try to get a rainy Saturday. Show. Yeah, I'll do the bare minimum work. Take care of me. <laughs> Make sure nobody dies. Water my crops. I already forgot which crop I've been like. Was I fertilized? I think I was fertilizing this one. And then water. And then fail at watering. I've been playing like a different game too, so like. Oh no, the controls are different. Uh, Grand Bazaar is like really weird having like B be the confirmation button versus A. Like, why is that- why is that a thing? Also, the next game I was playing also has R be the run button, but in this game it's L. Alright, so this is what I'm gonna do. I'm going to go to bed real quickly. It's not a rainy Saturday. I'm going to reload until it is a rainy Saturday. A light rainy Saturday. I must... I must emphasize. It is now a rainy Saturday. Alright, <laughs> that only took me like five tries. Okie doke, so... Do my regular chores and I guess... fart around outside of Freya's house. We have the necessary affection for this, I believe. Uh, Alright, also give some gifts. I think it's just it's just Angelo and Lloyd for now. You guys need food. You get a fodder. You get a fodder. Everybody gets a fodder. There we go. And also chickens. Uh one should be fine. Alrighty. Let's go hunt down Lloyd. They shouldn't be going too far. Because of the rain. So I'm kind of curious to see if I have... Okay, I could probably use this. Uh, the tea festival's coming up. Uh, if I have a high enough rank tea, I could get a party cake in return, and I, I kind of need the party cake. <laughs> I kind of need the party cake to make a party cheesecake, and Joanne just isn't selling it at the bazaar, so I'm gonna, I had to find a different method, other than, you know, just wasting some, some of my uh, flour that I'm trying to make by cooking it. There you go, Lloyd. It's amazing how much your skills have grown, Milan. You look like a real farmer these days. I pushed record, right? Yeah. <laughs> and I, I turned off the record button for a while, so my computer wouldn't fill up with space. Ugh, I have to, like, open my next hard drive. My my storage drive for, like, my videos is almost full on my third storage drive. Ugh, I think I, like, I think my first one, first drive is, like, four terabytes, and then I have a second one with eight, and then it goes up to twelve, and I think my fourth one is, like, sixteen. It's kind of funny, like, the years keep going, they keep, they keep, uh, compressing and being able to fit more terabytes of memory into, like, the same, the same hard drive. It's, just, it's the same size, physically. <laughs> Next time I'll get a 20 terabyte. Kind of funny, I could like just combine like all the stuff on my old hard drives and probably put it on like 
the newest version of a hard drive. It just has more space. Oh, shoot. Branches and weeds. Oh, I'll grab that. Thank oh, you very much. Alright, so we just have to park ourselves outside Freya's house. This is unfortunately a nighttime event, so it happens between 7 p.m. to 11 p.m. on a light rainy day. I don't know why the girls can't just have a little party if the rain's a little heavier. <laughs> and we need to have five hearts or more, more close ish to six hearts. Uh, the equivalent of like having a yellow heart with all the girls. So 40,000 friendship points. Uh, and you can only get this as a girl character, so... It's not your boy, too bad. I wish there was, like, a boy version of this event, too. That, that would have been nice, just... Nope, they, they just they just have one unique event for the girl. But yeah, it would have been nice to have a, have a bro version of this. Alright, so, I will be all creepy and wait outside your house, Freya. Until it's 7 p.m. Okie yeah. dokie. 7 p.m. Let's enter Freya's house. For a little girl gossip. <laughs> Hello, Milan. Perfect timing. What's up? I hate going out in the rain. But I don't want to just sit at home alone all day either. I, I sat alone. <laughs> I sat alone in the rain. <laughs> We <laughs> should be more concerned how, about how drenched I am. <laughs> so I'm glad you're here. I've actually invited a few people. They should be here any minute. Freya, we're here! Alright, got the lineup. <laughs> Sherry, Daisy, and Antoinette. Unfortunately, Emiko is not invited. They they probably don't even know she exists. Okay, looks like everyone's here now. <sighs> so he took all the credit for the project. Gasp. How could he? Really? That's so mean. <sighs> Who could do something like that? <sighs> That's really sneaky. Right? It's terrible. And that's not all. Then afterwards... I got a, got a cutthroat workplace there, Freya. It was fun talking with you guys. Yes, we should do this again. I think we'll get going now. No sleepover? Can't stuff ourselves into Freya's bed. We can spread out on the floor. <laughs> Did you have a good time, Milan? I wish there was more dialogue, like bouncing back between the girls, though. It's just like just Freya, just Freya. Little phrase about her talking about work. This is also like the only Freya like random event. The only reason why you need to bring Freya's friendship up, playing as a girl character, which is weird because I feel like yeah, Freya is a popular character. You think she'd be featured in more events? Good, I'm glad to hear that. I hope I'll see you again soon. Alright, no sleepover, just a little gossip. It does kind of remind me though, like all the girls getting together. Of the, the more friends of Bitteral Town. A uh, little sleepover event where everyone tries to stuff themselves in the same bed. But then leaves. That and like, it was also an exclusively like girl only event. Alright, some donuts. I can give that to. Hey, yeah. That's Cindy. I was like, which which sister is it? <laughs> Alright, so that that event we could cross off our list. That uh, that one was a little annoying to trigger because yeah, just like very very specific weather condition. Need the light rainy day on like a weekend. That's not a bizarre day. So like you only have one day out of the week to try and trigger it. Alright, so now we just need to speed our way to victory. Speed our way to summer. And then we'll have some fishies to catch. And some rival events to trigger. And some bugs to catch as well. Oh boy. <laughs> I'm probably gonna have to scum that too. Uh, 
I'm not sure where the beetle spawns. I know where the dragonfly spawns, though, because I did test. I did some tests. Am I really out of space? <laughs> oh, the blue feather. Does this combine? This does combine. I, I do need to pour this spring wine. Make a glass. Although you could buy spring wine in a glass at the bazaar. I was hoping the bazaar would accommodate that for me. Alright, let's go to bed. Let's go to bread. Keep. My fingers are all messed up after like playing a different game. <laughs> like the control schemes are different. I hate that. Get get used to one game and then try to bounce back and forth between a different one. The bazaar is today. Maybe our store will get a lot of business. I also need to buy some seaweed if possible. Although I can still buy the seaweed. Uh, we can still buy the seaweed in summer. Need it for like a few things. I, I already forgot. <laughs> I already forgot what. Is this a coffee? I already forgot what this is. I don't know. I don't know if it's gonna make it to the thirty-first. If it is coffee, I I don't need it. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, I don't believe I need it. Four star rank strawberry. Uh, okay, so I'll grab this. A cucumber can be upgraded. Oh, I need to stop running. No running. No running in the halls. <laughs> and no more spring crops. So just got. What are you doing over here? <laughs> Malo? What are you doing? There's something I need to get rid of. I should probably just sell the legendary treasure. <laughs> oh well, maybe, maybe some of this mint is gonna just get tossed out. Alright, what do I need? Uh, Angelo gift. Am I really out of space? Really? Rut row. Oh, I already have five star rank cucumbers. Uh, so I can put this away. Mmm, mm, 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 mm. mm, I don't know what to do with this inventory management. Let's start tearing out my hair. Nope, can't pick up branches. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, I got a red wonderful in there. I can make a strawberry seed and have it raise that rank up <laughs> by half a star. Alright, save the strawberry. Does this store anywhere? Not really. <laughs> Not really a spot to accommodate that. Uh, I can get rid of that. That little bit of fodder. Reduce it to one stack. <laughs> Got a lot of rotten food in here. She talking? I could probably get rid of this one. I'm not gonna need more than three. Alright. <laughs> Stretching, it. stretching it to the limit here. <laughs> and I believe I can toss this out. Yeah. Trash that. Ugh. So Lloyd is probably at this bazaar, setting up a stall. Angelo is probably still in his house. Let's go over there a little early. Still got a minute. Minute before they start. And importantly, next season, in summer, we can finally get some corn. We can make we can make some corn recipes like popcorn that we've been missing. Hello, sleepy Angelo. Been working on your art. I've been sleeping all week. I've just been. It's been a chaotic week. 
I've been doing a lot of sleeping, but I, I've been squeezing in some reading, too. And some playing other games. Potential next LP. Uh, but yeah, what, what have I been reading? Uh, I did finish I Tamed My Ex-Husband's Mad Dog, the novel. I thought I thought I was gonna be getting a manhwa, but yeah, I was pleasantly surprised with the with the novel. It was a uh, lot of lot more content, <laughs> a lot more content than just uh, a few few chapters of the manhwa. I am like I ate, like buying a full like a full comic full manhwa, and it's like oh we only got like that far in the story, and I have to like wait for them to translate the next the next copy. And the novel, too, comes out in a few days, so... Now we're gonna be able to continue the plot. Alright. Are we gonna beat any records? No. Now we gotta wait for the stalls to open up, too. I'm too early! Shen, sell some seaweed. I won't be able to fit it anywhere, but... Sell some seaweed. I need that. It'd be funny, I'll... I, I, mm, I could fit- I could fit stuff. I was like, I need a party cake. Which Joanne does not have. And I need some seaweed for- for cooking. What do you have? You have a strawberry pie? Is that strawberry? That's cherry pie. You don't need any of that. We are done. Over and done. That looks like all the stuff I've had before. I was hoping maybe that was chop suey. It's not chop suey. That's it. It's Shen. Alright, Shen, show me what you got, buddy. Don't sell me a sea urchin. I don't think I need that for anything. Da -da -da -da. It's a sea urchin. Rip. Okay, let's go to bed! We still have chances in the summer to get some seaweed. You better. You better, Shen. Be funny if you have to loop back around in next year. Can I fit this? I feel like mistakes are being made. I'm just picking up everything. Right, so we need to do bare minimum work right now. I don't really need any more fertilizer. I mean, I can fertilize the corn. But... I just need- I just need the basic corn <laughs> to create things. Hmm. <laughs> I'm doing the thing where I'm just like gazing at my inventory and being mad at it because it's so full. I think I could- I think I said I can get rid of this though. Wait, this gives me three extra slots. I- I don't need ore anymore. Right? Cause yeah, this- We've already fully upgraded all our rods, so we don't- I mean, all our tools are upgraded. I'm not really interested in making jewelry anymore. Okay, that gives me some real estate. I'm gonna clear out the ore. Like, I could also get rid of the pirate treasure, but I'm just like, no, it's special. I could catch another one, they're, they're just rare. Hey, yeah. At least with the ore, I can always just- Wait and see if Lloyd sells some. All right. All right, come and get it. Clearance sale. Copper really isn't worth that much, huh? Devin, wow. What are you doing? Making some jewelry? Be hard to work with just like pulling ore. I used to I used to make jewelry, but we had like metal sheets. So you can like just kinda sketch a design. Um and then cut it out with a, with a little tiny saw blade and then solder the Little plate pieces if you wanted to make like a layered piece on top of each other. That was just pretty, pretty easy. There's a technique to using the saw blade, like you don't want to push too hard. <laughs> it was like a little string, a little string with little barbs on it. 
And so you're just like delicately shaving away, like instead of shaving away the metal versus just like cutting it. Cool. All right, I got some space back. I could probably put some of this away, actually. Put it back. Let's put back the blue feather. <laughs> Go to bed. Alright, so our goal now is to get summer. Get summer safe and sound. Along with our wheat. We want our wheat to make it safe and sound. Hey, hey. And we want to make sure our animals are safe and sound too. Alright, the bizarre. The result is the bizarre. I don't really need to go. Not interested. Yes. Not gonna go. Someone else can take my prize. Alright, everyone's happy. No, no stress here. There is no stress on Lon Lon Ranch. Ooh, coffee. There it is. Coffee beans. <laughs> we can process it into into coffee packs and then boil it to make coffee. But I believe we just we just outright purchased all of our coffee recipes. The cappuccino, the hot coffee. There are not too many of them. So, it's probably a waste to just have those in my inventory, but then we have it. We got some cabbage. So a lot of the cabbage recipes I can make require flour, but I think I can make chop suey today. Walk, don't run. Water, water. Yeah, huh? Uh, we should at least make sure I have some cabbage in case I need to replant some more. Yeah, and I need potatoes. Gotta make sure I have those potatoes. Filling up the slots of strawberries. Some of those are gonna be sacrificed. Right, so let's make at least two potatoes. Uh, let's make at least two cabbage. I think hopefully six will will take us the distance. So let's make, I believe, one cabbage recipe I can make. Uh, da -da. Chop suey, we can make that. So we need cabbage, we need a carrot, we need a shiitake mushroom, and we need to fry that up in a frying pan with some oil. That's not so fresh, but that's okay. Right, make one of that. Alright, meet chop suey. It's your first time, recipe recorded. Cross that off. Cross that off the list. Every time I think of chop suey, I think of uh, Pierre's... The, <laughs> the Pierre's uh, heart event that required that I, I knew the recipe for chop suey in order to trigger it, which is weird, but okay. Alright, I'll just eat that. I believe most of the cabbage recipes now require that I own flour, so I just have to store the rest of it. Cabbage... A steamed dumpling that requires that requires flour. Flour oil cabbage for okonomiyaki. Rice flour. Can I do that? <laughs> Rice flour. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Do I have rice flour? I feel like I made rice flour. be a simple enough thing to make. I just need to pound it. Put it in the grinder. I believe it's this one. Rice flour, yes. 
take one of that. Is that gonna take like a, a minute or should I just go to sleep? 30 seconds. I can wait 30 seconds. Alright, and that will make me fried rice noodles. I feel like that that could potentially be used for like another another dish. Nope, it's just it's just a standalone. My cabbages. Alright, I think yeah, everything else requires flour. Rice flour is done. some uh, yummy stir-fry. Oddly enough, being called fried rice noodles, you do not require a frying pan for this. Uh, so you need a cabbage, rice flour, um, oil, and then you can choose one of the following. Either carrot, green pepper, onion, or shimeji, or shiitake. Uh, I guess I use a shiitake because I can just find that on the ground. Unless I have like a crap ton of onions. No, I, I, only, I only have a few onions. So let's use it. Let's just use, it. use another shiitake. There you go. Fried rice noodles. It's your first time. Recipe recorded. Alright, I'll eat that. Cross that off the list. Wham bam. Thank you, ma'am. Mm. Where is it? Where is the cross out sign? There we go. Mm -hmm. Save this for another time. One of you is gonna be a sacrifice. <laughs> I think it's gonna be you. You're, you're the odd one out. Right, eat that strawberry. Do, do, do. Right, let's go to bed again. Actually, no, don't go to bed. Uh, I think I forgot to give gifts today. It's like so much later in the day. I gotta go. Lloyd's still in the area. He doesn't disappear. Unless it's Wednesday. I didn't mean to hold that. I meant to wear it. Which I should probably be wearing the... Like, keeping the ring off of me. Because <laughs> in summer, I think the... The... The kingfish in summer requires that I have a one-speed wind day. <laughs> No, Lloyd. Okay, good. It's still early enough. He didn't like go into town or anything. <laughs> Let's go to bed. Anywho, what other books have I read in the interim? Uh, I read a kind of a crappy novel. Um, what was it? It's called Safe and Sound in the Arms of an Elite Knight, which I I guess it was sweet. The writing. Uh, I didn't really like the writing though. It did the thing where they they like described the thoughts of like every character like mid paragraph. I was like, I can just like describe the facial expression. I can like read between the lines. You don't have to like make a break just to do that. Uh, but it was very very sweet. Uh, a little cringy, but very very sweet. Kind of reminds me of like because I've been reading a lot of like the villainous genres. Tea party is today. I think I will participate in that. Uh, I've been reading a lot of the villainous genres, which shows kind of like the incompetence of like the previous like female lead. Like, oh, she's sweet, but like she's sweet to like everyone's detriment. Like, it's like everyone else has to like put in the hard work while she's just like the pure, the pure character, the pure innocent maiden. And just like, puts down like all the hard work that like everyone else has to do. Like for example, I think they did one in the accomplishments of the Duke's daughter. Or like, the main character would be like considered a villainess, like very cutthroat. Um, while the antagonist was like your typical, like, sweet, 
Otome, like, female lead character is like, oh, gives gives all the money to charity and helps the poor, but, like, ends up emptying the treasury to, like, give all the money to the poor. Meanwhile, like, the villainous, like, main character was using her money to, like, stimulate the economy. <laughs> So, like, ended up preventing preventing a famine. Alright, what am I doing? I am waiting. I'm... Actually, I can hunt down Lloyd and Angelo. And then I gotta wait till 12 for the tea party. I just want to do the tea party <laughs> just to get a party cake. <laughs> there you go, Lloyd. I also need to bring tea with me. I need four to five star rank tea. Doesn't matter what kind, it just has to be between four and five stars. Hey, yeah. mm -mm -mm. Do -do 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 -do. There you go, Angelo. <laughs> Such a fun festival. You're here early. You're gonna, you're gonna drink some tea and eat some cake. Now I gotta backtrack and get the. <laughs> you can probably use one of my, like, the Sencha tea. All those Eastern teas that I don't need for combining and making recipes. And then what else am I reading? I'll, give, I'll do the four and a half star rank tea. Uh, book 32! Of Ascendance of a Bookworm just came out. Kind of a, a lull on the conflict. Now they're just like dividing up the spoils and like the responsibilities of like the previous battle. But I'm kind of sad because I think it, I think the story ends at 33. I was checking like the wiki page for Ascendance of a Bookworm um, and seeing like what the Japanese novels, like how far the Japanese novels have gone and like it stops at like 33 so I don't think there's gonna be a part six I think like I think it's almost over I'm like oh it was so it was so fun but now it's over well I'll have, to, I'll have to find something else to obsess over all right I just need to wait three minutes for everyone to gather I will be right back in a jiffy hey. okie dokie yeah. it's 12 o'clock Give Felix some tea. Here we go. Great, let's get started. Not sure what sweets would pair well with Sencha tea. I don't, I don't see any Eastern desserts on there. Thanks for coming. Joanne has organized this wonderful tea time with tea and snacks for us. Actually, I just made the snacks. Alana's the one who provided the tea. It's very, very watered down. One can of tea. It just slipped between all of you. Enjoy, everyone. Right, I hope everyone liked the leaf water. Thank you so much for your help today, my lord. Here, please take this. Right, for our contribution, we get an entire party cake. <laughs> Let's do this again next year. That seems a little bit ridiculous. I am a single person living in a household, and she's just like, here you go, eat this whole party cake. And maybe I can invite some friends. What if I could? All right. Okay, let's put that away. Um, I need to make some cheese now. <laughs> the one reason I decided to do the tea party was just to get this cake. Uh, we I believe we already made the chocolate party cake. Uh, is, as long as we have like the base party cake, we can either combine it with chocolate or we can combine it hey, yeah. with either uh, good cheese or great cheese. The normal stuff doesn't count. And we can make a party cheesecake. I don't know how that works, because, I mean, the, the, I don't know, the structure of a cheesecake is, is so much different than, like, I don't know, like, it, that's, it didn't really make sense with the chocolate cookies either, because to make chocolate cookies, you need to melt the chocolate in the batter, um, So, like, the implication is that, like, we're just deconstructing this cake to, like, add a cheese or chocolate flavor. It just seems a little bit... doesn't make sense. But oh well, it's a video game. It doesn't have to make sense. It doesn't have to 
doesn't need to make sense. I just need to cross off the recipe off my list. All right, let's go to bed. Last day of spring. I'll grab the cheese tomorrow. All right, today's the last day of the month. No, it's crops will die, except for the wheat. The wheat will not die. Do, 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 do. We still need to water the wheat. I don't believe I need to grow anything aside from corn. That might be to my benefit, though, to maybe grow some tomatoes or something. What do I want to rank up? That's the question, is what I want to rank up. Examine the storage. Put that away. I should probably make some extra cucumber seeds. <laughs> like, having one is a little dangerous. I believe I already made all the pumpkins I need, pineapples I need, and onions. Yeah, I could just grow. I don't know. Let's, just, let's make that tomato into a full star rank tomato. Why not? <laughs> oh boy, more fertilizer. What to do? What to do with all this? Make sure I have like all the old seeds. Just like the reassurance, like oh, the potatoes and cabbages are there in case I need more. Uh, and while that thought is in my head, I let's make one cucumber. Because <laughs> having having just one is just dangerous, especially before they spoil. <laughs> Do I want to just go to sleep? Probably. Lloyd isn't even here today. He's not even here. Mm -hmm. Alright. For that recipe. Find it. You also need a seasoning set for this. You made a party cheesecake. It's your first time. Recipe recorded. I could probably eat a party cheesecake by myself. <laughs> I've done that before. Not in one sitting, but like... I had to... <laughs> like, I, I, I get so tempted by like the Costco cheesecake. It's like, it's pretty good. And... Uh, do, do, do. Although I think like my favorite of the past was like Trader Joe's one. Although I felt like the quality on that one changed a bit. It became like... I don't know. The texture changed. Uh, but yeah, I get tempted by the Costco cheesecake, and that thing is just enormous. Like, I would... I'd either feel really gross by, like, finishing it all, or it would spoil. <laughs> I think we can just go to bed. Feels weird, we're in summer! I, I do not have enough space. Rip. Sacrifice. I hope I have enough chamomile. I just have two. I do have the chamomile tea. I think I think I'm okay. Yeah, it's like all this, all this like combining is like making me a little wacky. I could probably drink this. And tasty. I'm gonna just drink that bottle of wine. I already have six bottles of better wine. Alright, let's go to bed. Alright, how far do I wanna go? Do I just wanna make it to the next day or do I wanna fish today? Decisions. Decisions, decisions. So, um, if you want to do Dirk and Antoinette's event, uh, we could start it on summer day two of year four, but it also has to be a rainy day. And otherwise, it could be a Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, or Friday. Because we can't do it on, can't do it on the weekend. Let's grab what I need, and yeah, let's go make some friends. Hey. 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 Hey.
I don't want to bounce on all of you. Oh boy, summer music, so happy. Uh, one of you is an orange. I'll just fertilize all of you. <laughs> Increase yield. Uh, I don't need any of you. Spring is over. Mm -hmm. I'll grow the tomato. Maybe we'll get make it to the next bazaar. Uh, then I can get some corn. Oh, exciting. <laughs> The, the thing that I could have gotten in year one, but didn't buy it, and then the game just, like, refused to give it to me until year four. Hey. Any other things I should fertilize? I think that's- is that the peach? I don't need peaches. I'll fertilize it just in case. Oh, I'm going out. Eight o'clock, breakfast is over. Good morning, Lloyd. Alright, Angelo. I should give Dirk a little chat. I can I can find him tomorrow. Okay, there's still chamomile on the floor, so... <laughs> we can potentially pick more up if we need it. Yo, Angelo? You're almost at red. You're almost at red. Also, I probably should look out for any, like, cream croquets so I can get Dirk up to red. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm gonna marry Dirk, but... It's a possibility. Because I, I like him, but I married him in the last game, so I'm, I'm very conf very conflicted. Not the last game, but like the last, last game. Tale of Two Towns. Right, should we do... Yeah, I'll try to get to the next bazaar. Quick days, got about that saving. Friday, it's not a rainy day though, but from this point on, we can get Dirk and Antoinette's events. We're just gonna have to scum. We're just gonna have to be full of villainy and scum. So the one I use, the cheap one. <laughs> This quality fertilizer, I am for certain gonna get a five star rank tomato. Let's grab some gifts. I do want to check Joanne's store inventory, but waiting till 10 does seem like a little bit of a pain. But maybe we can fish while we wait. Let's see, what what fishies do we need to catch? Let's aim for like a summer exclusive fish. Um, other than the kingfish. Uh, the kingfish we can get in summer. It has to be a rainy a rainy day with one one blue mark of wind strength. So level one wind. Which is why it's important to take off the wind ring. <laughs> the green ring, so the wind speed isn't too high. Uh, that's gonna be another annoying thing where the stars have to align, but it is what it is. <laughs> Good morning, Lloyd. that, um, one summer exclusive fish we can get. Um, if it's a cloudy summer day, we can catch a fish fossil. 
Um, and then otherwise, summer. We can uh, large eel as a summer exclusive, and sea bass as a su summer exclusive. For some reason I think I caught a sea bass, but whoops, I might be thinking of Animal Crossing. <laughs> oh yeah, you're at red. We'll just top you off. <laughs> All right, so sea bass, we can catch up the manufacturing windmill only. So I guess we'll, I guess we'll fish here. <laughs> we'll fish here until ten. How did the sea bass get so far out here? We're not even at the sea. Maybe this is the closest we can get to the sea. Got an eel. All right. Well, that's a nut. That's a year-round fish, so. Uh, it's not the large eel, though. Kind of weird. Kind of weird. There's an eel and a large eel. Uh. Okay. Not X. Y. <laughs> I'm like, oh god, what's the button? <laughs> what's the button to put away the fish? Uh. That is my fault for playing a, a different DS game that has a altered control scheme. Grass carp. Oh, that's a weird name. All right, that's an another all year round fish. Press Y to put away. Another grass carp. The largest grass carp I've ever caught. I can also catch a loach at the at the manufacturing windmill. I wonder if that one's gonna be hard to catch. I don't know. My my logic is that uh, loaches are just hard to catch because of Zelda. The Hylian loach is always like super rare, like the rarest fish. A boot. I don't think there's a a registration for the boot. I remember Magical Melody, you have to get to like the left and the right boot. It's for completion's sake, they're like, why? And bigger. And one of the boot, one of the sides of the boot was like harder to catch than the other. <laughs> it was like a pseudo legendary fish. The trash boot. Eel, another eel. That's a bigger eel, but not, it's not large. Yeah, we, we can catch a large one at the Zephyr Cafe or Raul Shop, so other other section of town. Mm, I suppose I could probably just switch up the area I'm in. No, wait. I'm still trying to catch the sea bass. Getting distracted. Alright, this will be my last fish and then I'll go back to bed. Oh, there we go. Sea bass. Perfect. Yeah, this is this is summer exclusive, so... Get it now. Before we, like, hit up fall. Yay, my fishing run up! rank one up. I am now a professor? <laughs> a professor fisherman? Not not professional? What? I am now a fish professor. I'll, I will teach you all about the fish. Okay, I was gonna sell the fish, but I guess I'll just eat the fish. Um, okay. I guess, I guess it's dangerous to eat raw eel. I can eat the raw sea bass, though. Uh, I guess you're going in the garbage. You do not get the privilege of going in my stomach, I guess. It's- that's fair. You don't want to get sick. Alright, what do we have? Not- not cream croquets. Yeah, pumpkin pudding and corn soup. None of the above. All right, let's go to bed. Yeah. Is tomorrow bizarre day or is it an event? I don't think it's an event. It might be a birthday. It might be someone's birthday. Mm -hmm. 
is, it is Wilbur's birthday. <laughs> Uh, let's go to bed. If it's rainy, we can potentially get an insect. But we can't get Dirk and Antoinette's events on a rainy weekend. Okay. This is neither. Those cherries? I'll just leave those. I'll just leave those on the tree. I don't think I need cherries anymore. Just waiting for... Waiting with bated breath for those oranges. I can make orange wine. Then make summer wine. And then make four seasons wine. I do want to do some shopping, so let's try to catch this other fish, the large eel. Uh, we can catch this in front of the shops, the Zephyr Cafe, or Raul's shop. Uh, should I do Raul's shop? I'm trying to I'm trying to do like a like multiple birds, one stone. I think I can catch a big-headed carp in front of Raul's shop as well. Let's fish. Past far. Also, I forgot to grab the gifts I need for Lloyd and Angelo. Hmm, should I do that now? I'll do that now. I see Angelo going to my farm, so... Okay, there's a large yield. <laughs> there it is! Cross that off the list. Bam. Angela, I'm gonna grab the omelette rice before it goes bad. Alright, give me some eggs. Simple black egg. Wonder if we have any cows that are like ready to ready to rumble. Ready to compete. Romani? <laughs> Man, I guess Romani is our, our best bet. Unless we want to enter Crimea again for a double win. But she's, she's old. She's about to die. And then they die. <laughs> Good morning, Lloyd. I need to get you to orange. Uh, where's Angelo? Is he not there yet? I thought for sure. I thought for sure he would be... I'd bump into him. <laughs> gotta go- gotta go this way instead. There you are. Good morning, Angelo. That piece when I draw here. This might be my favorite spot in town. Staring at a wall. Not even at the landscape, just, just right at the wall. Gotta draw. I <laughs> gotta examine all those wall textures. Let's see. Maybe I can catch a char here at the grinding windmill. We can catch those spring, summer, and fall. Rainbow trout? I already caught one of those. Yeah, I caught one of those. That's old news. Fishbone, that's that's not a that's not a fish. Missing the flesh. Where's the rest of it? Another rainbow trout. I think maybe I hopefully the rainbow trout isn't too common. Alright, there we go. Charmander. First time I caught this fish. Doesn't seem that big. Uh, can I eat it? Or maybe I should just sell it. <laughs> A lot of fish that they don't allow you to eat raw. 
Maybe it's a life lesson. Old games, you can just eat whatever. Yeah, eating raw fish is dangerous. Uh, potential for parasites and everything. Better to cook the flesh. Alright, Raul, I will sell... Sell everything for chump change. I don't believe I need this for any cooking. I believe I made sure to make all the fish recipes. If we need something, we might have to backtrack and fish it up again. Alright. Sold. Let's check out Joanne's store. Hey. <laughs> At least there's different stuff in here. Tomato salad, pumpkin pudding. I might need to get an alternative gift for Dirk. Uh, d -d -d -d. I was hoping for cream coke case, because that's the most efficient. Uh, the other options are not too many of them. <laughs> I could buy some at Claire's. Maybe like an egg rice bowl, boiled tofu, or tempura bowl. Or some milk stew at your end. Hey. Alright, let's do the bazaar tomorrow. I'm not sure what, how we're doing on time. I know we did cut out a bit. Waiting for this one event. <laughs> oh, that girl got up on it, but yeah, let's let's at least get to the bazaar. Today we're buying corn. It's our mission. Oranges. There we go. Bananas too. But more excitedly, oranges. <laughs> Uh, do I need two of those? I need one to turn into a glass for myself. And then one to turn into Four Seasons wine. And then I can finally... I believe I can finally put the wine behind me. Right, so orange. I'll do one at a time. To make it faster. Okay, that's still gonna take a while. Rip! No, it's gonna take forever. Right, let me go look through my recipes. I don't think there's any orange, like, desserts that I need to make. But it doesn't hurt to check. Oranges. Yeah, it's like fruit sandwich, but you could use, like, many other fruits for that. Fruit shiratama. It's just like orange wine that's like exclusively you need the orange for. All the other recipes are like, pick one of the above. Alrighty, not too bad, not too shabby. Uh, I guess I can just eat this. I don't think I have space for it. <laughs> I still have time to harvest another one off the tree if need be, but yeah, we're like, cry we're crying right now, we're crying for space. Rice. Hey. Grab an egg and yeah, wait for the bazaar to happen. I guess I guess we can fish in the meantime as well. Uh, what I say? I need I need that loach. Loach and big-headed carp. Gotta pick one, one or the other. Yeah, let's go hang out at the waterfall for a bit. And the loud, the loud splashes. Probably sounds. <laughs> Hopefully, it's not too loud. There, right, big headed carp. Silver carp? No, that's not it. Bigger cart. Right, not the one. Not the one, though. Getting my hopes up, though. 
It's like, oh, it has carp in the name. Silver carp, why is he so common? Five star silver carp, but it's smaller. <laughs> but it's smaller than the other one. It's higher quality. It has a it has a greater sheen. It scales. I don't know. There we go. Big head carp. First time catching this fish. All right, mark it off my list. Wonder what what rank is after fish professor. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get fish. I'm gonna get tenure fisherman. I still got like a minute. Uh, duh, 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 think we can bother Angelo, and then the loach we can only catch at the manufacturing windmill. Which I mean, it's almost ten, so <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna stick around for long. Hey. No, I didn't want to bounce it off Felix statue. <laughs> Actually, maybe I'll fish until eleven, because not all the stalls open up. Takes them a bit. Takes them a bit before they open up. Let's catch this loach. And then all the other fish <laughs> after this. All the other fish after this require like weird weather conditions. So we can catch an ocean sunfish in summer, but it has to be a stormy three wind day. I'm gonna run out of space. I feel like I'm gonna run out of space. <laughs> And then, yeah, the fish fossil we can catch on a rainy day. Not a rainy day, a cloudy day, sorry. Probably can't even sell it for that much money. <laughs> I remember Taylor Two Towns, I was like, ooh, fish fossil! It's like the money maker before, like, you can get pineapples. But now in this game, like, at this point, it just barely elicits a reaction, because you can only catch it once you get the long rod in your four. Eel. All right, a few more. Bazaar is open. It's almost 11. wonder how many corn I should buy. Should I buy like two or three? <laughs> I remember corn having a long like regrow time. Probably don't have to go to him. Need enough to cook like popcorn or something. There we go, the loach! Cool Rooney! Alright, that's all the basic fish. Now we, yeah, now we need the special the special kingfish and like all the stuff that requires the weather. And my bag is full, so. <laughs> can I eat what can I eat? Uh, I can give Lloyd this egg and then maybe I'll sell the rest of the bazaar. Good morning, Lloyd. I bring an egg in these trying times. Okay, selling oil. That's that's not seaweed. Yeah, let me get some some pity change here. All right, today I'm a fishmonger. They've just been caught today. Fresh fish. I catch them. You buy them. Oh boy. <laughs> I think that's everything. Alright, sold all the items. I'm done. Whew, so, so much hard work. My goodness. Alright, corn is the important thing today. I'll buy three. Fertilize one. Cook with the other two. Do, do, do. And there's no new seeds. We already got the oranges. Already bought. I think we have soy we have soybeans, which we can use to make soy flour. I think it's like anything else I'm missing. <laughs> All right, what other recipes do you have here? Chop, chop suey. Of course. As soon as I make it, you sell it. Well, I wouldn't have known. <laughs> I could have not gotten lucky and not get it. 
dry curry. Darn, if that was regular curry, that would have been useful to me. Okay, I'll take that. That's one less need for flour. <laughs> All right, I learned the recipe for herb cookies. Now I just need to make walnut cookies, I think. Yeah, just need to make walnut cookies. Which I do have walnuts, I just need to bottle them and then... Yeah, I still need the flour. Which I believe the flour should be coming soon. It's surprisingly... Surprisingly, uh... As soon as, like, the wheat sprouts, it's just, just like a hop, skip, and a jump away from just being done. Herb cookies. Alright. That's been an okay haul. I got I got the corn I needed. So alrighty. So I, I think... I think we probably stop now. And then hopefully next episode, we'll- we should be able to get a rainy day, <laughs> like, normally. Dirk and Antoinette's last rival event, it's like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday. Like, one of those has to be a rainy day. Uh, but I think the challenging one is gonna be getting Claude's- that random event with Claude and Antoinette. Uh, hopefully I can trigger it. Yeah, I wasn't able to trigger it last year, but it requires- it says a stormy Thursday? I wonder if- if it meant stormy- a stormy, uh, like- or just like a heavy rain day. So I might have to do some testing to see like which- like what is it? Like which one is it? Maybe I'll do that off screen. So I like- I know for sure like what weather condition I need. Right, and then yeah, we still need that blasted rainy day to catch the stupid beetle. Alrighty, but otherwise I think we're good. I'm just gonna wait a few days to get that orange one. That stuff is slowly pulling together. Hey, hey. Mm -mm -mm. Alrighty, yeah, so yeah, I'll just play this next week normally. Like, for sure. <laughs> Hopefully, for sure, we'll get a rainy day this this week. If not, I can scum for it. I kind of want to try scumming that Thursday, actually. Should I play a few days ahead? If I, like, end on a Tuesday... Then, like, next episode, I can easily scum, like, that, that Thursday. For, like, the correct weather condition. And hopefully, we have enough friendship with Claude and Antoinette. They're at nine. Should be fun. He's at eight. Yeah, let's get to Tuesday. Sorry, being like super wishy washy. And watch the day be rainy? Nope, no rain. Okay. Uh, oh, right. Bizarre day. There's also bizarre, bizarre on us today, but I'm not interested. I caught like, I got like 4,000 gold. <laughs> I'm not winning anything. Hey. Sweet, I can get rid of, I can get rid of some fertilizer. I'll do a quick, a quick gift run. Surprised no one's getting sick. The cats are doing their job. Oops. Didn't mean to bounce on that bubble cow. You know what I still want to do? I still want to see if I can get some cream croquets. <laughs> Alright, Lloyd. Unfortunately, there's no other fish I need to catch in these weather conditions, so... I don't want to just stand around for two minutes doing nothing. 
Hello, here's your unnecessary omelette rice. You're already at red. I feel like in terms of like favorite bachelor, <laughs> I, mean, I think Angelo is probably second to last. <laughs> I'm sorry, people like Angelo. I thought I would like Angelo and Ivan, but yeah, they're like at the bottom. <laughs> Oh wait, I just blow. I just need to blow on the windmill. Hello. Hey. Maybe I'll get cloudy day. Cloudy day I can catch fish fossil. Alright, one more day. At least one more day. Oh, it's a rainy day! It's a rainy Tuesday! Okay, so... Yeah, I can quickly splice this in. Um... So I, have to, I do have to wait till 10. It's a 10 to 12 event, and yeah, yet again, I do have to splice it in. Uh, because yeah, for some reason on my girl version file, it's it's glitched out, but I did trigger it on my boy version file, so no trouble there, at least. I guess while I'm waiting, I can... What a one win speed day is it? Hmm, ho hum. Yeah, I think for the kingfish, I need rainy day one blue mark strength. Really, it's two. It's pl two blue marks. Oops. Alright, run, run, run. I don't have to water today, although I, st I still need to check my crops anyway to fertilize them. My five star re wheat is already like getting to the next stage. Soon I'll be able to make flour. I miss the days where flour is just like a given thing at the general store. <laughs> It's just, it should be a staple thing. Like rice. Rice and flour should be offered at the store. Using so many recipes. Okay, sweet. You're finally at orange. I think Lloyd is probably a good contender for marriage, though. And I know someone really likes him. He's like, he's kind of middle. Though, but like, he gets extra points. Like, he, he's cool, but like, he gets extra points because like, he doesn't pop up in any of the other games. Like, Amir pops up in another game, and Dirk pops up in another game. So like, I feel like I have a, a second opportunity for marriage. <laughs> oh boy, and I should probably. There's gonna be some multiple cuts here. I I wanna cut... I need a cut to do Dirk and Antoinette's events, and then I need a cut again to try to get this stupid beetle. This stupid Atlas beetle that I've been, like, trying to get for two years. Hey. I can only catch that one at night, though. Hello, Dirk. Alright, I guess I'll sit on my hands for a minute. Really, nothing else I can do. Uh, it's at Claude's house, I believe. <clears throat> yeah, even though Cla Claude is going to work. Oh my. Kind of weird, it's like implied that, like, Dirk. It's on. Yeah, it's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, so, like, it has to be, like, on a day that, like, Dirk t typically works, because the cafe is closed on Thursday. But Claude goes to work, so. I don't know. Is, is Dirk. Is Dirk skipping work? In order to to mac on Antoinette, <laughs> just like looking at the the trigger conditions, just like making my own conclusions. Um, I guess I can just like wait like forty seconds uh, until this happens. And yeah, it's like I guess this was like really hard to find online as well because of like the the glitch that. Prevents you from triggering it if you trigger like Angelo and Daisy's rival events first. 
but yeah. I feel like it wasn't too bad, though. To, like, I was able to get on my boy file. <laughs> but yeah, that glitched, though. Luckily, like, there's no marriage component that would, like, prevent them prevent it from happening, but... Yeah, it would have would, would, would have been a big bummer if that like would prevent them from getting together. But yeah, it's just an event they can view. All right, so I will splice this in. You have to enter Claude's house, 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. Hello, I'm coming in. Hmm. Nobody here? Oh, Antoinette! You're here! Great! Hey, you startled me. What do you want? You seem kind of sad recently. So I, uh, was wondering if something was wrong? What's up? You can tell me. I'm a good listener. I don't know. Maybe I should be more talkative. More like everyone else. But when I try to talk too much, I get so awkward and uncomfortable. Why? I think you just stay how you are. I mean, if we suddenly got all chatty, it would freak everybody out. That's rude. <laughs> hey, I'm trying to be serious here. Antoinette, don't worry. Everyone understands. <laughs> Besides, I like you just the way you are, Antoinette. No. Oh. <laughs> Shoot! I hate to run, but I've got to get to the cafe. But we'll talk more soon, and... Cheer up, okay? I feel a lot better. Thank you, Dirk. Okie doke. <laughs> there, there's the last Dirk and Antoinette event. Hey, yeah. All right, let's go check the store. Now I can finally mac on Dirk. Oh, sweet. Okay. Oh, uh, we have we have cream croquets. Perfect timing. Now that I no longer need Dirk and Antoinette, or Dirk rather, at yellow. Did I buy ten more? I th Let's see. Ten, eight thousand, sixteen. Should be enough. Yeah. I think we'll also hit up his birthday, so that'll, that'll max him up. Up and out. Uh, I'll buy two more. Okie doke, so... Hey, yeah. One more thing. I keep, I, keep, I keep finding one more thing to do, so now, now let's skip to 7pm. And hope I can catch this Atlas Beetle on my farm. Okie dokie, 7 p.m. Let's keep our eyes peeled for this beetle. There are there are fireflies on the floor, which is promising. I think on heavy rainy days we don't even we don't even get those. Let's check all the trees, but I'm pretty sure it pops up on the one that's next to my house. Just run around a bit. Check check my other trees. Okay. Didn't see anything flutter away. By 8 o'clock. We have a few chances until 12. Yeah, the anticipation and potential disappointment. I might have to scum for this too. Probably have to scum for both the Crimson Firefly and the Silly Atlas Beetle. 8 o'clock. Reload the zone. 
Nope. Hey. At least need to go. Maybe if I like get rid of some of the other bugs, like some other ones can spawn. In case there's a in case there's a spawn limit. Hey. The other critters. Oh, the frog disappeared. Alright, not here. Try again at nine. I'm <laughs> just double checking the corners. Hey! Hey! Yeah! Hey! Yeah! Holy, <laughs> it's, it's a long episode. <laughs> Kept thinking, like, eh, it's gonna be short, gonna cut out a lot of things, but nope. I'm just like, eh, let's try to just get one more thing. One more thing. There's always one more thing. I wonder if I should try, like, exiting my house. Eh, other stuff is spawned. So it does reload the bugs. I swear it's, like, right- I swear it's right there! It has to be that tree. And then the white one usually spawns here. I'm not looking for that one. Looking for a hey. typical brown hey. beetle. Get everything else off. Booga booga. Scare, scare off that firefly. Hey. Also, did I feed my cows today? Might have forgotten to feed them. No, no, they have food. Hey. Hey. Oops. Yeah. Stressed hey. out my sheep a bit. Forgot, forgot that happens. That's not the beetle, but uh, that's kind of bad that I missed catching it. Hey. 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 For certain it should be there. I'll try reloading coming out of my house or barn. I'm afraid like exiting too close to the tree though, like it'll, it'll spook it. It'll do something dumb like that. No little frog. Hey. Uh, I feel like someone's probably gonna see it. Be like, it's right there, you fool! I'm like, but I don't see it. <laughs> Let's try again at 11. This is like the last chance. If it's not there, then... Next, next rainy day. Are you serious, game? Yeah, like, it makes me think there's something wrong, but I also had this much trouble catching the crimson fire- uh, crimson dragonfly. Hey. Yeah. But when I, like, double-checked by scumming it, I was like, oh, no, it's it's actually there. I just have terrible luck on screen. Hey. Hey. Alright, so yeah, this is not- not popping up today, so... Yeah, I guess maybe next time. Gonna check all the other locations. Hey. Not on that tree, not on that tree. Not on that tree. Alright. Well, it's time to end things off. So maybe next episode I will try to... I'll try to figure out how to do that one Claude Antoinette event that like requires a stormy Thursday. I need to, I need to clarify like what the actual weather conditions are. Um, and then, we'll probably, you know, we'll, we'll sleep pretty quickly. We'll get our corn probably ready to cook. Maybe our flour will be done. There'll be a lot of cooking that we gotta do. Maybe we'll do the cow festival. I, if I lose, I lose. I don't really need to like get multiple winning cows. I guess it's like a one at <laughs> once uh, in three years thing that you can potentially get a champion cow. And then once we hit summer 22nd, um, we can get Ivan and Freya's last rival heart event. And then I will have no qualms after that in getting married. 
We have to make our decision after that. So if I'm not gonna pick, I'm probably not gonna pick Ivan. So I could probably just make the decision like after I like after I see that event. I wanted to give like everyone a chance. So like I wanted to see like all the rival events first, but I don't think I really need to get them to orange or to red, other than to get that one random event with him and the girls doing math problems. But yeah, that's like all we have left. We're we're slowly getting getting through it all. Alright, anywho, we've been going for a super, super long time. Uh, I hope you guys had a fun and relaxing time, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye. Uh,